Welcome back guys, we're back with another one here. And today we're just gonna be talking about three things that can cause arguments in a relationship and how it can kind of affect the relationship as well. So with that being said, I'm Jarvis and this is my girl Marielle. And we're here with the topic talks, let's get it. <laughs> okay, so number one reason why couples argue is social media. Ladies, it's just a picture, it's just a like. Facts. Nah, you ain't liking nobody pictures. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> nah. Um, my opinion with likes, I know I have a couple girls that you know I'm really close with, and there was like, oh, my boyfriend's always liking this girl's pictures. She's always naked. Me personally, I do not agree with guys liking naked pictures when they are in a relationship, and it's just because I feel disrespected, especially when you don't have the same body type. It makes you feel so insecure, so uncomfortable. So yes, I do not agree with the liking pictures. Nah, not me. Uh-uh. What do you think about that? I mean, to me, I just feel like it's... I don't know. I feel like we're innocently just liking a picture. Like, yeah, some guys may do it because they're like, oh, shit. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, probably those guys are not in a relationship. To me, it's just an innocent like, like a scroll like, scroll like type of, type of thing, you know? Mm -hmm. So I don't know, I just, I understand how a man should respect their woman with, with things like that, which is why I do it. Like I just, my really doesn't like it. So I just, to avoid arguments, man, like, nah, you know? <laughs> so, I don't know. Yeah. and Everybody's going to have their different opinions. Somebody, uh -huh. sorry to cut you off. But we want to hear what you guys think. We want to hear your opinion. Yeah. Like we, this is not just for us. We want you guys to watch this video one. Two, I mean, maybe there are some things that we can, we can, you know, say in this video where you guys may be like, oh, okay, I see. And, you know, vice versa. We might read something and be like, oh, all right, that's a good point. Like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So definitely interact. Definitely um, give us a comment and let us know what you think about all this stuff, you know? Yeah, so I was going to say that all of those things lead to, like, us feeling uncomfortable, being insecure, and overthinking, like... Oh, we see you guys liking all these girls' pictures where she's like half naked, but then if she has a picture with no clothes, I mean with clothes on, like, y'all yeah, don't like it. And I'm not saying you, but like guys in general, like I've seen that, I've witnessed that. So I feel like out of respect, like for your girl, just don't do it to not cause any arguments. And from that, from like that, that causes like assumptions and then they're going to start assuming. And it's just like a whole big deal. So if you really respect your girl and she tells you like, you know, I don't feel comfortable with you doing this, then I wouldn't do it, but that's just me. Cool. Um, What's the next one? Next thing is quality time. Def. What do you think about quality time? I think quality time is key. Definitely key. Um, I don't know, just doing random things. Like, plan it out if you have to, you know, just to do things. Plan it out with, with each other. You know, have something on. If you guys work by calendar, have something on your calendar. Like, yo, this day we're going to go, I don't know, skydiving. You know what I mean? Just to have some fun, show that love to your lady, and don't just appreciate, you know, just the small things. Something I learned, you know, we've, we've grown with it, we, you know. We don't really like to go out as much, but, you know, sometimes, it's not perfect, trust me. There's sometimes that you need to spend more time with me, and I'm, you know, I'm like, shoot, I do, I do. And I mean, it shouldn't, it shouldn't have to get to that point and it will it will always get to that point just like you know you need to spend more time with me or we need to start doing more things you know stuff like that yeah but i totally agree this there, there should be quality time with your partner um because at the end of the day i mean that's your rib man you gotta be there um i feel like yes everything you said i agree with but also the way you guys spend time with each other because just because you guys are hanging out doesn't mean you guys are actually spending time with each other like for example okay go ahead I was, i'm confused <laughs> right. uh let's say okay so jarvis and i live together right uh but sometimes he's always on the xbox which i don't have a problem with if he spends time with me you understand so there'll be days where i'm just like okay he's been consistent on the xbox every single day so now i'm just like i'm just chilling by myself in the back you know so it's like just because we're together in the room and like you know like it doesn't it doesn't necessarily mean that we are spending quality time also what i mean by that is when you're gonna spend time together make sure that your partner is involved and engaged in the things that you want to do or you know vice versa because i've seen couples that one of them wants to watch a certain tv show the other one is like 
oh i don't like to see that like that's boring to me and mm. you know girls like they like to watch the little chick flick stuff you know so it's it's kind of like a little complicated you know because everybody always wants to see different things but in a relationship i learned that you know just trying to be engaged in what your partner is like doing like wanting to see or you know even like when like i know jarvis he has his basketball games i go to every single one of them even if i have to wake up early the next day i still go because at the end of the day i want to show him that i'm his number one supporter regardless so, so, of anything right so with this one is like support literally yeah. just support each other um and even if you don't like to watch the show like just just watch it anything anything that you don't like and they like and you know that they enjoy do it because you know what i mean at the end of the day Hopefully they're gonna do the same thing for you. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? There's some things that my lady likes that I don't like, and I just you yeah. know, I go along with it just because you know we gotta support each other. You know? And sometimes there's things that he puts on that I'm just like, eh, and I just end up falling asleep. But I can't blame myself for falling asleep, right? I feel you. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> so the last thing I feel like people argue about too is that when they're in an argument, they make the situation worse. Yeah. So arguments. When you're in an argument, the argument gets worse if like you just keep adding fuel to the fire and yeah common sense whatever duh like yeah but like there's ways to prevent that man like like you know what i'm gonna let you go first like what are your ways to prevent that what do you think that, that you like know? to prevent an argument from happening not or even just preventing an argument just like in, the middle, in the middle of an argument and then like how do you prevent it from getting worse um Okay, so usually when Jarvis and I argue, they can either go pretty bad or they can be all right. Yeah, it can be so bad. when it's pretty bad, I kind of just stop talking, and he'll be like, "Why are you so quiet?" Oh, so now <laughs> now you now you ignoring That's people. True. Okay, so I become this mute person, and it's not because I I don't want to respond to him. It's just because like I don't want to make the situation worse. Like I just when you calm down, let me talk to you then. You know, I feel like when you guys go both. Get, like going at it you guys are both like you guys both are in like fire at the moment so you yeah. guys are gonna like go fire and fire and it just doesn't work out it just doesn't right. work out so me i just kind of when i see that it's just getting to the top i'm just like you know what i'm gonna just stay quiet and i feel like also people like when they argue they don't talk about the situation they don't well actually no they may talk about the situation but they don't fix the problem just because you speak about the situation doesn't mean you fix the problem. Okay, so now you guys spoke about it. So what now? How you guys are gonna prevent that from happening again? Like fix the situation. Don't mm. let it go unnoticed. Gotcha. Keep working on whatever it is that you guys are arguing about. Gotcha. So for me, I've, I agree with a lot with like everything you said. The only other thing that I would say is like, I don't know, do something that even after an argument, I don't know. I don't want to say like this that distracts you, but like, just like for me, an example, like I would just be like, yo, uh, I'm gonna just go play basketball, you know? You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like some, there's some days that she doesn't go and watch me play, and it's not because she doesn't want to, but it's because it's so heated that like it's not. And again, it's not that we can't be near each other. It's just so heated that, you know, like I said, one takes the high road, yeah. and you know, the other one just whatever. And then after that, you, know, you come home. And it's not like acting like never, like nothing ever happened, but like you come home and you just feel better. I just play ball, man. I let, you know, let everything, you know, go, you know, mm -hmm. just leave. My mind is free and boom, I come home and then that's it. Like, yo, you know, if you got to apologize, apologize, man. It ain't, it's not that hard, man. Like Biggie once said, spread love is the Brooklyn way, man. So let's, let's, <laughs> let's just do it that way, man. But I feel like you, like when I'm at work, is when you go play ball because sometimes I could be in the room and we could be mad at each other and you'll be like, nah, you coming yeah. with me. <laughs> nah, I know. I feel, like, yeah, <laughs> and I'm like, I don't want to go. I'm mad at you. Nah, I know. I feel you. Sometimes I do do that. Just like kind of... But to be honest, nah, me watching him play kind of just like, that's my ego. All. Like, I'm just like, oh, I'm not even mad anymore. I just watch mm -hmm. him play. So, I don't know. I think everybody should just... Just taking a break yeah. within the argument. Just... Mm -hmm. makes things so much better you guys don't get heated you guys don't start you know making holes on your walls mm -hmm. anything man just but like I said just because you guys feel better after you guys are distracting yourself from that argument don't go don't let that situation go unnoticed go back you know 
be the bigger person talk about the situation i apologize for this i apologize for that you know i should have never spoke to you that way or such and such so but that's what i think of that and cool i mean we wanted to do this you know because we're like yo we should do that and um honestly we're Today we're not home. We're we're at this little park I and know. stuff <laughs> because there's a lot of people over, you know, our house. My mom's is there and everything. So we were like, we're, we'll be back, you know, left with our cameras and everything. And we just obviously needed we needed to see you guys, man. Or y'all needed to see yeah. us too. So you know, we, you know, we just came out here real quick, filmed this video. Mm -hmm. um, we've been wanting to film it, you know, and giving you a different scenario i guess D different scenery yeah um so um the only reason we chose three reasons why couples argue is because i feel like those are well we feel like those are the main like problems that people have with social media the you know not understanding each other in, in an argument and the quality time is one of the biggest things you know and then just fixing the problem rather than yeah. just acting like it's all good there's so many things uh couples argue about but this is our this, list. No, yeah. this video is just gonna be too long, and you know. <laughs> Definitely, yeah. This is our list, and this video is just gonna be way too long if yeah. we just rant on. So, mm -hmm. if y'all got, I mean, anything else that y'all think people argue about, you know, or if you're in a current relationship and you think that you're arguing about, you know, certain things consistently, like we want to hear about that too. You know what I mean? Like, we can learn from you guys too, just as much as you can learn from us. Mm -hmm. So. You know and what I'm saying? One of the biggest things relationships should always have is communication. Yeah. Always so communication key is key. Today. Yes. Key um, message today. Communication. Communication. <laughs> yeah, and um, you know, always speak with your partner for everything. I go to drivers for any little thing, versus like my mom. To be honest, like I just mm -hmm. I don't know. He's my backbone. So for any little thing, I literally text him and I was like, babe, what do you think about this? What do you think about this job? Like this and this and that. I always go to him for any little thing, even if I don't need his permission. I always ask for his permission regardless yeah. it's just it's respect in the relationship and communication and yeah yeah as always comment like share subscribe and if you're new to this page make sure you hit that like button subscribe you're gonna love us man stop stop fronting you're already <laughs> looking at us you're gonna love us hit that you know what i'm saying so with that being said we're gonna check out right here you got anything else to say any last words so guys, you heard Jarvis earlier about Topic Talk. So this is something new that we've been trying to do. So if you guys have any topic you guys want us to talk about and get our point of view on things, let us know. The couple's arguments um, was one of them and we chose three reasons why. So if you guys have any suggestions on things you guys want us to speak about, please let us know. DM us. Uh, Leave a comment, comment. below, anything. Yeah. Um, Y'all got our numbers. Some of my friends watch this anyway, so just hit us up, man. Uh, any topics y'all want us to talk about, man, we just gonna talk about it. It's not gonna be, you know, we just gonna do it. Just yes. do it. We're gonna be like Nike, man. We just gonna <laughs> do it. You feel me? So, um, definitely something new for us. So, Topic Talks is our thing. It's gonna be something that we implemented as a part of our channel. And we talked about this, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Just an idea that we wanted to continue to do for our viewers, all right? So, we're good now. And we're gonna see you in our next video, all right? Peace out, JM gang. <laughs>